Did you know? Levi Strauss, the founder of the brand Levi Strauss never wore a pair of jeans. Crazy it may sound, but the founder of the brand, Levi Strauss never did wear his brand. Levi Strauss was a German-born American businessman born on February 26, 1829. He founded the first company to manufacture blue jeans in partnership with Jacob W. Davis, a tailor from Nevada in 1873. Back in the time when the brand was launched, jeans were meant for factory workers, laborers, miners and farmers throughout the North America. Business persons, especially the successful ones like Levi himself, did not wear them. Levi Strauss, as a matter of fact, wore his quintessential dark suits and white shirts. Levi Strauss died on September 26, 1902. It wasn't until the 1930s that jeans became more mainstream when they entered the Hollywood scene in popular westerns. Back then, jeans were associated with cowboys and the movie stars who played them. Later, in the very early 1950s, jeans were just starting to become more of a fashion trend thanks to actors like Marlon Brando and James Dean wearing them on a pretty regular basis. After James Dean popularized them in the movie Rebel Without a Cause, wearing jeans became a symbol of youth rebellion during the 1950s. During the 1960s the wearing of jeans became more acceptable, and by the 1970s it had become general fashion in the United States for casual wear. The history of jeans is one that has left its mark on the world, we all have a pair of jeans or two in our wardrobes. However, you can't help but notice the rich and varied path that denim has taken to get to where it is now. If you like the video, please hit the like button and subscribe to our channel.